Welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 Long War 2. This will be Operation Doomhammer, and I know I said I kind of I had my eyes on a different operation at the uh, the end of the last video, but I didn't actually recognize this was already at 145 preparation. So we've got a squad of six, including a new squaddy, a new ranger squaddy, only one grenadier, so there's going to be a lot more shooting and a lot less uh, blowing things up as opposed to previous missions. So very light, vulnerable. And we'll be getting a whole bunch of enemy material, corpses, supplies, the whole shebang, which will no doubt be very, very useful for us in the long run. Now, obviously, you can see we've got a whole array of laser weapons, which will be very nice to have back, as well as our troops, because given that we're having quite the glut of missions lately, there is no doubt that we definitely want to have a few more troops, and uh, the more readily we can have troops available, the better, because, you know, ultimately, it, more troops means that we can do more missions, which basically means we can further advance our progress against Advent. So, press the key to launch, and um, of course, we'll have to see how it goes. Now, I've actually failed this mission once because of a single mistake, a single mid key press, which was unintentional. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> um, but um, but for now, we'll we'll take this as it is. So um, like so. One thing, one thing about this map is that it's actually a relatively small map where it seems to be in the bottom right corner. There's a building right in front of us which we can take advantage of but you can see the map doesn't really advance much beyond this particular building. So we, defi we definitely want to be careful because the mobs will no doubt clump up very easily. We definitely want to take advantage of any possible flanks we can get and any possible squad side other bonuses we can possibly get. So obviously we'll probably want to try and get up to the roof but like I said before, the roof is pretty much in the middle of the map, which basically means that if we, if we get any attention, it would not be the friendly kind of attention. So uh, let's pull back to the corner, and then and then we'll get, we'll get some patrols walking this way. The good thing about this map in particular is that um, is that the did I say it was a good thing? Heading to that location. Uh, anyway, I said the main the the main idea is that we 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 get we get everyone we get everyone in a relatively safe positions and then we can kind of just um mouse over watch until someone comes and then we can pick them out. So um, it's basically kind of see what happens and since there's no timer, since our goal is to basically kill all aliens, we can kind of just take our time and overwatch as necessary. So um, which is. Obviously the ideal thing to do, but probably not the most user-friendly watchable thing to do, so the least I can do is kind of just get the ball rolling in exploring the area and kind of just getting more ground as we push forward. So uh, with you, this is a steady weapon because we're still kind of just pushing out, moving out. Um, now, that's a window over there, so there we'll now. get you to peek, take a look inside. Into designated position. Okay, so far seems to be pretty good. New, uh, you can... Roger, I've got my eyes on. So, and then let's just see who, who else we get get to push forward. Um, okay, and got Sophia, no, Sarah, Marlon. Marlon, Marlon, Marlon. Marlon. Alright, and then everyone else can go and overwatch. 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 Quiet. Did you hear something? Okay, so, you know, it just occurred to me that since we're in the bottom right, we should actually be focusing our efforts towards the left here. So, if we hurt stuff here, what we can do is actually move inside the building to uh, get the ball rolling. So, or we can actually just hop up onto the roof. I think the roof might be a better idea. So, let's get you up here. Heading to that location. And it looks like you can do that pretty safely with no issues. Uh, let's get you over here. All over it. We don't want to be... We don't want to be too aggressive or too close. Uh, new connect is a bit further that way, and Varun. Well, since you're a newbie, we should give you that height advantage. So let's get you up here, not too close, and then that should make life a bit easier. Uh, sniper, sniper, we can get you a bit closer. Uh, it's the new weapon. Pretty please. They'll come. Okay, still hearing things, not seeing things, so, um, definitely won't engage this turn. Def uh, let's see if there's any cover. That's a bit far. We'll get you to the edge. Understood. Moving out. And it doesn't look like we'll be seeing anything just yet. Moving to position. Because basically we know they're somewhere in that direction, and unfortunately this is a bunch of buildings, so, uh, which is actually not helpful. But the least we could do is get our sniper up here. Moving out. Ah, yeah. Alright, uh, let's get moving out. Get closer. Affirmative. New. Covering now. 
You should probably That's affirmative. And then Bruin. Affirmative. Moving out. It's interesting, I've had a few students named Bruin, so I don't know. Alright guys, are you guys gonna come out or not? Let's get a bit closer. Moving on target. There we go. We enemy squad here. That's a big squad. That's a double squad. Okay, we're we're only gonna engage one of them. So we're gonna need to restrict our movement. So Nuke is the only one who can actually see both of them right now. And apart from our sniper as well. So we're gonna wanna be fairly careful. Um, so if I move you down here, um, and then we're gonna pull you back to inside the building. So which one can you see? You can just see those two. So we want to pull Newt back, not activate this group and deal with this group. Because basically the one advantage they have is that they're all going to be clumped up in here. I'm on it. Um, so that will actually give us a bit of an advantage. Um, now, the problem with the roof is that um, there's literally no... Well, not literally. There's um, this pool cover here, but not so much anywhere else. So we kind of want to spread, we kind of want to spread people apart as well. So it um, can be a bit of a contentious... I like that word contentious. Can 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 feel a little contentious, a bit of a contentious issue. I need I need to actually look look up what it means. Alright, um nuke, you can go on overwatch. Uh we're gonna we're gonna have you guys on the edge. Um but I think I should actually move our grenadier down here. Like back here. Because he can basically launch grenades from distance. But I also want him to actually do either get some or targeting. And then, uh, Vroon, while you're up here, move into position. you can overwatch. And I'll then, Sniper, on. we can move back. Steady weapon. Then we'll see how they move. Okay, so those, those guys are coming closer. And those guys up there are, are staying there. So what I need to do is actually move Sophia away. So I need to move Nuke back here. I'm on the move. And I need to move Sophia over over here. Oh, she can't. That sucks. That actually really really sucks. So let's get it's Sophia back out. here. Um, Marlin. Now Marlin looks like you can still see the guy over there. So we're gonna get you to pull back. Now. now who can you see? Okay, so you can. Understood. Moving out. Pull you back. Don't we don't want to see the officer. Someone else could still see the officer. Who is it? Two, three, four. No, so it's gotta be this guy? No? That's really strange. I'll get you back Let's here. Do this. You you can see. Moving to Overwatch. And then you've got Moving to Overwatch. Still can see the officer, that's not great, so... Okay, so, still can see the officer. Who can see the officer? I can still see the officer via squad site, but... Oh, it's Sophia. And she's stuck, so the best thing to do now is to catch them in the overwatch trap. So I'm gonna put you over here. So so the plan is now is that we get everyone on overwatch. Affirmative. They're gonna come up they're gonna come up close to Sophia. Scanning. And she's gonna be seen. Um and then moving out. On Overwatch. Eyes on the prize. Roger, I've got my eyes on. And then uh, we'll get you to. No, you, oh, you can actually see them from there. That's actually pretty know. good. So. Overwatch. Yeah. So the plan is. Um, the plan is now uh, Overwatch. Uh, do, do I want a pistol Overwatch or do I want a steady weapon? I think I want a steady weapon. So if they. Oh, they're moving back. Well. Don't want to see the goddamn officer. Okay, you can move. Who are? 
we move here, can you see the officer? That's that's the only question I have right now. So if we move here, maybe I should just really count. The problem is like I don't have the zoom function for the map. So if we move here, over here, yes. So it doesn't look like. We we'll try this. Position confirmed. Can't see the officer. Hurrah! Okay. Um. Now, how are we gonna execute plan? Someone, ex someone is exposed, and we overwatch, and we overwatch trap them. The other thing is that we could just shoot. And um, I think it would be silly if we didn't take a take that advantage right now because we can definitely kill them all this turn. So. The question is, who do I put on Overwatch? Um, well, basically, I want to Overwatch someone who can only take one shot this turn. These guys can take two shots this turn. So... I feel like I'm overthinking this. Like, maybe I should just take a shot and be done with it. I definitely want to hit the Sidewind. I want to, I want to hit a Viper guy first. So, can I smack out the Sidewinder this turn? Okay, I think I can do that. So what I'm gonna do is get... No, he's not gonna overwatch because I'm gonna need that grenade. So, Sniper is gonna take out the Sidewinder. Alright. There we go, one less, one less Viper to worry about. And then now we've got Death on the buff. So that's definitely, that's definitely the way I wanted to do this. Okay, so... Marlin, 72, 72, okay, you've got really good shots, so we'd be silly to squander that opportunity. Um, you've got one shot, but you could throw a grenade. Um, you can definitely type do that, and then throw a grenade over. Um, looks like you can, you can only really get... Nah, yeah. oh, this sucks. So... Okay, so you're gonna just throw, throw a grenade over to... Yep. Like, nope, that's that's pretty good. Alrighty. Let's see if it destroys the, the hole. Oh, well, we've got a critical hit, so that's definitely something. Uh, Marlin? 77, 72, okay. Nuke, 52. You do have demolition, though. That's something we can take advantage of. Um... 60 or 55. I didn't take both the 55s. Alright. Yeah, that works. And then you can take the 60. Nice, nice. Both grazers, but both are still technically hits, which are still wonderful nonetheless. Alright, so nuke. Uh, oh, I forgot. We can hollow target. Now, I need to worry about the heavy rocketeer, so 92, 72. So, let me hollow target the rocketeer. There you go. And then... 92, I'd be silly not to take that, but um, I feel like... We've got a double 82, that, and he's, he's much harder to hit from a distance, so... I think it's definitely better to hit him instead. Thank goodness for Executioner. Only the best. Only the best indeed, and you've got a nice juicy flank right here. Is it clear? I hope so. Off you go. All right, that's everyone dealt with. Now we can we can pistol Overwatch, Overwatch. for the next for that next mob that will probably. Oh, they didn't. Okay. Well, I'm not complaining, but we should probably... We should probably be super, super careful. Um, how, how are we going to handle this? How are we going to handle this? I don't want him to move because he's far away. I, I, I want Marlin to move forward. Possibly? No. The problem is if I move it down there, she's got to activate the officer, so... The problem is that's a little too close for comfort, and I didn't quite count properly how many... 
So that's there. And then I think it's Sarah down over here, but that might activate something, which is not something I want right now. Um, I know I know here he's safe, so I'm going to get Nuke. Like maybe a bit closer. All right, I'll go. Uh, Overwatch. Overwatch. Marlin. Cobra. Get a pistol Overwatch. Covering now. Marlin. I really want you to reload an Overwatch, but. Sure thing. I'm on it. And then you can steady weapon. Nothing. So it looks like we're gonna have to activate them. Okay. So the question is now, who should we activate them with? I'll go. I got it. Oh, they're quite clumped up to get over here, which is a good thing. Um, that means a, a grenade should. I don't think a grenade's gonna reach that over there, crap. Ah, oh well. You can definitely give that guy a good smack. Okay, we need someone to be close and throw a flashbang. Um, so you can definitely kind of go up and throw a flashbang there. Um, you, what can you do? You can definitely get behind cover and start shooting at something. I hope it's worth it. Oh, you could demo, you could demo the building cover. Wouldn't that be nice? Shield bearer, please. Don't think that did much. Heading out. 96? Oh, very nice. 96, uh, 30% crit is not great, but we, we may as well take down the officer while we can. Alright, uh, let's get you up here. 78, pretty please. Nice, nice. Oh, more loot as well, of course. Very welcome. Um, Shubo is definitely exposed, so... Oh, that's the sergeant, okay. Uh, that's not great, actually. So... Who else do I have remaining? 92, 87, 82, 62, 62... No one can see the shield bearer, that's quite interesting, actually. Um, 87... No, you won't be able to kill him. 82... If you kill him, you get a death from above, which would be nice. All right, steady weapon. We got we got another steady weapon. So we got a steady weapon. Cobra. So you're gonna run and gun and throw a flashbang, or you could throw a flashbang right now. No, you, no, you, you, you gotta run and gun and throw a flashbang. Okay, kind of dumb, but the fire position. Is it clear? because of that guy over there. So flashbang right up here, smack in the middle of all of them. The problem is it's actually quite hard to see inside the building and it doesn't look like I'll be getting all of them. Just, there was one pixel in there. And, or, well, we definitely want to smack the shield bearer because otherwise the shields will be kind of annoying. So that looks good. Take a good look. I sure will. Okay, got four of them, so not too bad. If only I had a trench gun, trench gun would make this such a piece of cake. Oh. Here. That was not a flank though. Oh wow. Incoming fire. Man, hide advantage is a bitch. I'm not gonna lie, they had some very, very lucky hits. Thankfully, we've got a med kit on the ready, so... First, you gotta get close and throw a grenade. 
moving to designated position. If you can. Uh, wow, okay. Looks like we're not going to have much luck on this one. Bombs away! Alley -oop. Well, we're capable of destroying force, that's definitely a given. Seven fifty-two. Okay, I would like love for you to take my shots, but that's not gonna happen. Um, God, light them up. Target All right. So that's one, and then you can reload. Rock and roll. Don't think we have enough people to really take on the people we need right now. Um, uh, Marlon, who can you hear? This sucks. I think that's pretty much a given. Um, go in here and... Oh, I can do here and blast, blast the shield bearer in the face. That would not be very safe though. Make sure you can kill something though. Would be nice. 67 or 52. Okay, okay, that works. And then so that's an overwatch removed. We can blast the shield barrier in the face because we don't want the shield barrier to be moving around. Uh though it's really not a good idea given given who else we have out at the moment. 67, 62, 62, 77. Just go for that guy, if you will. No, that's not good. Adjusting sights. Hmm. Well, that's one down. That's right. Probably a few too many to go. Um, how are we going to do this? Can we stun the shield bearer? We can. There we go. Alright. Oh god. Wow. Taking fire over here. Alrighty. I'm taking fire. Okay, he's moved down. That's interesting. And Overwatch. Okay, so he's got two more turns. Our sniper needs to start moving. I think that much is obvious. Um, I'm gonna have my sniper run the Overwatch. So she'll take the free reload, and then where is she gonna run? Over here? Already there. No, oh, she didn't activate the overwatch, okay. That's fine. Um now what are you gonna do? Fifty and sixty-seven. You you can only you actually can't see them, which is kind of annoying. Um Okay, so what I want to do is kill that guy because he's the most annoying person to us right now. Um, don't know what Cobra could do though. 35, 31, because that guy's hiding around there. And as soon as he moves, he's, he's, his Overwatch is going to go up. And there's there's two there's two more Overwatches. The only question is is like how how does he how can, can he get up and if so how. Um, Seems like the only way you can get up is through the stairs. So technically that means this guy can be shot at and I don't have to worry about her being I don't have to worry about Sophia being shot. What's over there? Okay, superior size, sure, that Go looks good. Here. And 70 oh. 
That's risky. That's a darn shame, that's what it is. Um, how, okay, what do we do? What in the ruddy heck do we do? Um... I want to do like one move and then command or throw a grenade at this guy. So... Get you to reload and then frag this guy. That will blow, blow things open. Ideally. Nope, still behind full cover, that's lovely. Alright, well... There's only one thing we can do. Take both shots at him and hope, and hope one of them hits. Come on, newbie. Oh, you got one more chance, newbie. 50. Uh, okay, fuck it. You're, he's getting a flashbang. This gonna be bright. Just. Oh, this is a frustrating, frustrating experience. Shubo is no longer stunned. Oh my god. Nope. Okay, that's one way. I'm all right. All right, looks like he's moved. All right, he's on Overwatch. Your bear is coming down and doing his thing, I guess. I suppose as long as I kept him busy all that time, it's not that bad. But yeah, goodness knows. I mean, yeah. Okay, well, we have to... Okay, so, stabilize. That would be good. There's still a guy with a mech around though, so, which is not great. Um, 67, 62, 67... Pretty please? No, no, no. You know what? I'm gonna get you in here. I'm gonna give him a good arrow bolt to the face. That's more like it. Alright, so... Marlin. I don't have any grenades that could uh, keep him on the down low. Now, I just need to find some means of actually flanking him without actually... Activating him, I guess. 62. You're really not going to be able to do much with that. Um, you can't see anybody. You could probably, like, hop on the back. Here and flank someone from behind. Yes, you can. I'm going. Isn't that nice? Um, 65, 23. Okay, you know, just take out that guy. Okay, so I got one. Oh, oh, that's right. You got hit and run. Wait, can't you? Sh Hold on a second. Getting an additional move action. I should have chosen close combat specialist. I am so pissed at myself right now. Is it clear? Okay, got Get one. That's fine. Yeah, I didn't get it. How did I not realize?
more than one way to skin a cat, I suppose. Um, shield remove. All right. Well, pretty please with a crit on top. Oh, that's contentious. Okay, well, uh, let's pull you back. I'm going. You. Moving to position. You. Uh, I should have. Can Marlin see that guy? She cannot. On my way. Come get some. Ay ay ay. Let's do this. Go over me. All right, still bleeding out, and then let's see. She's still got. Alright, she can do the same thing again. Lovely. Right, I'll go. Off you go. One down, thousands Positive to confirmation. Go. Area secured. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. That went really, really badly, and I am super, super pissed at myself for not realizing hit and run does not give you a second turn. Oh my goodness. Um, I can still use Sophia, um, it just means I have to use Sophia differently. So, like, um, oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm gonna have to use Sophia a bit differently. Ah, uh, I'm so pissed. Um, I should have taken Close Encounters. Not Close Encounters, cl uh, Close Combat. Well, uh, what is it? My brain is so frazzled. Because I'm so annoyed, uh, I didn't realize Hit and Run. Because I assume Hit and Run was like as it was in the Firaxis XCOM, in that if you shoot someone when they're flanked, you you get another action, not just another move. So um, lesson learned. Lesson learned. Um, I don't have the time to retrain her though, so we're just gonna take this as it is. Except that Sophia's not necessarily the best of um, all soldiers, but. Um, I'm just glad that we all got back alive, even though they're, they're going to be spending a long time in the med bay. Alright, so low profile, let's go for center mass. And then, what? Patel! Alright, you've got 72 plus 10, so... Um... We've got 72 aim to begin with, I think warp fire would be much more useful. Uh, okay, and then... Alright, so scope, superior side, 47 supplies. Okay, that's very that's very much appreciated. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I'm so pissed. Um okay, let's um let's see what the GTS has. We can train an officer. Um Spider War Dog. We actually have quite a few, so I, I actually need to figure out who I can send out first before I actually um so let's take a look at the missions we have right now. So destroy alien relay, rescue resistance contact, expires in four days. Oh, we 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 have got people on that. Um hack the wood station in the advent facility. We could five days your hours is a bit cutting it close. Neutralize the target, that's not gonna happen. Supply rate. Expires in 32 hours. This is a one day eight hours. Uh max squad size ten. You, how many available soldiers do we have? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That actually might be enough. So I'm going to do a range of the technical gun, special. That's actually quite a good mix of people. But I feel like, oh boy. Um, you know what? Let me let me figure out what to do, and then um, we'll, we'll start this hitman mission the next the next time, and then. Um, that, and then I'll figure out whether to do this supply race. So yeah, as always, thank you for watching, and I will see you on the next video where we will take on Operation. Uh... You know what? Let's just Hitman Jailbreak Operation Deathbreaker. See you then.